Well, you send your children to school for an education, not for a sex change, but increasingly in this country, public schools seem like they're the most dangerous place for your children to be. Parents have been complaining for a while that schools are helping their children to transition gender without parents' knowledge, mm. and now it's come to uh, attention that schools are actively encouraging children to question their gender. Year 7 students at Northcote High School in Melbourne, now Year 7 students are 12, 13 years of age, received an email, it was published in The Australian Today, and this email was received by students without their parents' knowledge. Let me read for you what this email to 12 and 13 year old kids actually said. It said the well-being team have created a survey for students who would like to be known as a different name, gender or use different pronouns. If this is something you've been thinking about or if you've one of the many students we've already supported with gender affirmation, please click here. And then listen to this little uh, note for students. Please note if you choose to fill this out, your information will be private and we will not out you. In other words, we won't tell mum and dad. We would just like to organise a time to chat and help you navigate what happens next. Well, Liz, I tell you what would happen next. I'd be marching straight into that school principal's office asking him, what the hell are you doing with my kids, who, by the way, will never darken the doors of this school mm. ever again. This mm. is outrageous behaviour by schools. This is patently wrong, and I can't even imagine parents uh, who have an LGBTIQ child or similar would be in favour of this because it's being done in secret, and that makes it patently wrong. What really gets me is that last line. We would just like to organise a time to chat. All of this will be in secret too. What's mm -hmm. going to be said in that mm -hmm. chat and help you navigate what happens next? Well, what if I'm just gender confused? You're going to give me a, a, a menu of next steps that I can take? They are now encouraging and pushing kids down the path of transition and why you would ever encourage anyone on a lifetime of drugs, surgeries, hormones, you name it, that you supposedly love is beyond me. And all the people who complain about school chaplains promoting Christianity in schools, do you reckon they'll complain about this? <laughs> not of course, a Of course not. And I mean, when you've already got teacher shortages around the country, we keep pushing things into schools that don't need to be in schools. Teachers have a hard enough time as it is without making them the, the arbiters of whether kids are into gender fluidity or whatever. Just let the teachers teach and the schools deal with education. It ain't hard.